Next up, we got some Onyx. A lot of the times you'll see they'll come in these plastic bags just to get a little bit extra protection. Nice and slick. So these ones are, uh, I can feel they're PK. Uh, they're just a little bit more firm. Yeah. The LW version's just not going to be as, uh, as firm. It's going to be a little bit more squishy which uh, some of you might prefer. It's a little bit more comfortable, but the PK is, is a lot closer to, to retail. And so the main thing you kind of want to be looking at is these holes. I'll get some close-up shots for you guys, but in each of the holes, you can see well, these are all perfect because they're the expensive ones, but on the cheap ones, you'll see little plastic like flaps in the holes where they're not fully opened all the way. And that's just because they either have lower quality control or a lower standard for what they let through. They don't take that extra step of clearing out the extra plastic from the mold. Another big spot is on the toe. You can see where the injection mold is right on the tip of the toe. That's another good spot to look at. Next up, oh, we got another PK. Individual bag for each uh, each shoe. Got these, these ones are a little bit smaller size in case they look a little different, that's why. These are the Anorak color. They kind of look like white, but they're a little bit off. Let me check the box though, because they could. Small chance that they're sand. <laughs> they, these might be the sand color, it doesn't say on the box. There's a lot of different colors of these. I know I don't have every color. There's a few I, I skip. I think some of the uglier MX colors. Yeah, I really like these. They're a little different. Uh, you do have to wear them with socks. Oh yeah, these are interesting. These are one of the MX colors, which is where I'm guessing they take multiple colors of plastic and they just kind of mix it all together. like moon or something maybe MX black you can see this box is in good condition a lot of the ones got squished these are called desert sand not to get you confused with regular sand and then so you can kind of see you've got a little bit of mixing where you've got a little bit too much light You've got mostly that yellowish color, and then you've got little patches like here and here and here of like a darker brown color. And of course, two of them. And that was kind of, I guess, I don't know, I bought them because I know they're not going to make them anymore. So, I figured I'd pick them up while I could. Look at it. Right. Ooh, these are fun. I like these. These ones are red. And their technical color is called vermilion. And you can tell it's a very exciting color. These are also the most valuable 
on the secondary market. I remember these were like over selling for over 300 at one point. And a wrap. Uh, these are in size 13 now. It's kind of cool. Uh, these are definitely PK. The packaging on PK is a little bit better. Arro, no, not Anorat. Arro Rat. Arro Rat. So these are PK batch versus the other ones being LW. I can't tell the difference, but if you guys can, then props. PK version Onyx. The other ones I've shown you were uh, LW. These ones have a pretty strong plastic smell. You gotta let them air out for a bit. And then, this may be the final pair I can show you guys is the pair that I've been wearing. I've been wearing these for like maybe two or three months now. Wear them out. So like restaurants and stuff. I haven't really been like, I haven't really been jogging in them or anything like that, but you know, they, they hold up when you wear them. Super easy to clean. You can, uh, you can put them in the dishwasher to clean them if you want. I'm just kidding, I haven't done that. Usually I just spray them down. These are the Onyx. You can tell they're turning a little bit gray, but these are a PK version. So overall, I mean, I really recommend these. They're super durable, affordable, and uh, they're versatile, you know? You can wear them with a a lot of different things and a lot of different, I mean, you can wear them in water, you can wear them. You do need to wear them with socks though, that's one thing. Uh, I got my, my girlfriend a pair of these and she destroyed her feet wearing them without socks. And that's because they pinch really hard right here. That's how they stay on your feet is this narrow area right here. They usually look better with uh, wide leg pants rather than like skinny jeans, but you can wear them with anything. But yeah, for the cost of 25, 30 bucks, you get a shoe that's really easy to clean. And uh, I'd say they're easy to style, but that is not everybody's style. And, oh yeah, you can see a little bit of tread wear on the bottom. Anyways, thanks for, uh, thanks for coming by and checking it out.